Oh, hello there. Do you still remember the story of Peles? Aha! Marge! Hi, Joji. Did you draw all these? Yeah, I did. I wanted to make a different version of the story. A different version? Yes. I'm going to be changing the ending of the story. Change the ending? Hmm, you will see. But first, I will need your help. Okay, what is it? Will you arrange these? I still need to get the last picture for the ending. Sure. Help me arrange these, okay? Great! I will need the right arrangement so the ending will make sense. Okay. Thank you, I'll see you later. Okay, let's do this. Which of these pictures should go first? There's asking for seeds from Hugo, waiting for seeds to grow, passing by Hugo's farm, and planting the seeds. Right! Passing by Hugo's farm happened first. So this should go first. Next, Pella's asking for seeds from Hugo. So we should put this next to the first pictures. Okay, two more. Which is next? Yes, planting the seeds. And of course, this is the last one. He is waiting for the seeds to sprout. Looks like we are done arranging these pictures. Joji said he will change the ending of the story. I wonder how he will end it. In the original story, Pelis' tomato seed sprouted, but he got sick. I wonder how Joji will end it. How do you think it will end? I was thinking of the same thing. Hi. Hello, Joji. I arranged the pictures according to the story. Wow, thank you. Let's see. Passing by Hugo's farm, asking for seeds from Hugo, planting the seeds, and waiting for the seeds to grow. So, how will you end the story? Here. After seeing that the seeds did not grow, Peles gave up. He left them there and didn't bother taking care of them. So, when the rainy days came, he had nothing to eat. Aww, that's a sad ending. You don't like it? Well, it sounds okay, but I'd rather have a happy ending. Hmm, how about you change the ending of the story? That's a great idea! I will change the ending of the story you just made. I just need a paper and a marker. I think I have some more papers and markers over there. How about you? How would you end the story? Let's finish the stories by thinking of its ending. I will show you some pictures and let's think of how they will end. Ready? Here is the first set of pictures. A spider climbing a tree. Then a storm came. How do you think this will end? I think the spider will be washed away by the storm. Do you have the same ending in mind? Here is the next set. A boy saw a papaya tree. He climbed it. While climbing, the branch of the tree broke. How do you think this will end? I think the boy will fall down the tree. Did you think of the same ending? Here is the next set. A boy finds a lost and hungry cat. 
He brings the cat home and feeds the cat. How do you think this will end? I think the boy will keep the cat as a pet. Do you have another ending in mind? A girl watching the rain. Her mom telling her that she can't play outside. And the girl playing outside in the rain. How do you think this will end? I think the girl will get sick because she played in the rain. Did you think of the same ending? Great! Oh, hey there, it's James Les Reed here. And do you remember the sound of the letter A? That's right, A, ah, like in the word apple. But sometimes we read it as A, like in the word apron. We call this the long A. The short A sounds like a, apple. Long A sounds like a, apron. And to help us remember better, I wrote a song about it. <laughs> you want to hear it? Okay, here goes. Have you heard of the long A? Long, not short A. It sounds like this. A, not A. Ah. It's A. A, the sound of the long A. Cake, bake, table, and tape. They all use the long A sound. Game, maze, nail, and pail. They all use the long A sound. Have you heard of the long A? Long, not short A. It sounds like this. A! <laughs> Guess the long A word by looking at the four pictures. What is this? Snake. How about here? Tail. This is the next one. Train. How about this? Are you sure? Try again. Cape. Correct. This is chain. What is this word? Grapes. How about here? I don't think that's the answer. Try again. Gate. What is this word? Skate.
cane. This is the last one. Plane, correct. Awesome, now we can name them all. Snake, tail, train. Cape, chain, grapes. Gate, skate, cane, plane. They all use the long A sound. <laughs> I'm now done with my own version of the story. Are you ready to see it? Great! Thanks! As you can see, Peles tried to wait for the seed to grow. But he got impatient, so he left the seed and did not take care of it. That's why, when the rainy season came, he had nothing to eat. Now here's what I've added to my version. Hugo learned what happened and went to Peles' house. He brought food for him, and as they eat together, Hugo taught him how to take care of the seeds, and that patience is important. Thanks to Hugo, Peles promised that he will again plant tomato seeds and take good care of them. The end. I like that ending better. You do? Thanks, Choji. I hope you liked it too. Well, thank you for being with us today. We'll see you again next time. And I hope you had a great time because my room is your room. Goodbye. Goodbye.